Hello guys, good afternoon. Well, right now it's 4 p.m., so it's afternoon, right? When you see the video, it's going to be good evening, right? Um, well, today, unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to be with you. I'm not going to be able to be with you in the class, but you have this video, right? In this video, I will tell you the activities that you must complete, okay? Remember, not because I'm not here, it means that you are not going to work. You are going to work, right? So today, I know, I know, I'm going to skip some activities, and I want you to go to page number 60, right? Go to your student's book, page number 60, and you have this activity, which is reading activity, right? Um, well, I mean, you can pause the video, pueden ponerle pausa al video, completar una actividad, luego continuar y así. Yo solamente voy a dar las instrucciones, right? If you have any questions, I will be in the grammar, uh, in, in, in the grammar, I'm sorry, in the WhatsApp group, okay? So, uh, reading is the first activity that you will complete today, right? And it says here, read the magazine article, so which is this magazine article, and you need to complete the sentences, right? So look at here, you have two sentences. Number one, Richard and Sharon met for the first time on where? Is it a place, a day? You need to read this, right? Number two, the second time they met, they went to what place, right? So obviously, first, you need to read the text. Um, you can pause the video, start reading it. If you have new words, questions, or doubts, I will be in the WhatsApp group. And number two, look at this. Read the article again. Put the events in order they happened. Write the numbers one to eight, right? So you have here eight sentences that you need to order basing on this reading activity, right? So if you need, please read it again so you know what happened first, second, third, fourth, until the eighth, right? Uh, remember here, van a ordenar los enunciados basándose en esto, right? And well, Let's go and finish today, guys. You're going to finish with functions talking about past events. Hmm. You know, you now know how to speak in the past, right? Remember, we worked with irregular, regular verbs, negative, using didn't, right? So here you are going to talk about a past event. But what is the event, teacher? So number one, think about when you made a new friend, right? Remember that time when you met as a, a, a new friend, right? Cuando conociste un nuevo amigo. Acuérdate de ese día. Hmm. It was at my new job. It was at school. It was at the English class. I don't know, right? So, cuando conociste un nuevo amigo. So, what are you going to tell us? Who is your best friend? When did you meet him, right? When did you meet him? Where did you meet him? And what happened? How did you two become friends, right? So, first answer the question. Van a contestar primero las preguntas, ¿no? ¿Quién, cuándo, dónde y qué sucedió? Recuerda, esto es referente a un amigo que hayas conocido. Pero acuérdate de ese amigo que a lo mejor el último, a lo mejor el primero, a lo mejor tu mejor amigo, right? Acuérdate quién fue, cómo se llama, obviamente, cuándo, dónde y qué sucedió. Look at this. This activity, it is a speaking activity, right? So what you are going to do, you need to send me this activity in the WhatsApp group. I want you to send me an audio telling us this, right? Entonces, actividad última del día, speaking, tell your story. ¿Cuál story, teacher? Pues esta que estabas pensando de cuando hiciste un nuevo amigo, right? Ble el ejemplo, fíjate, dice aquí. I met my friend Al five years ago. Al, right? That is his name, Al. Su nombre es Al. Five years ago, I was on vacation in Florida with my family. We were at a small hotel. Al's family was in the same hotel. We made friends on the first day and spent the whole vacation together. So this is the story of this person, right? right. You guys are going to do something similar, right? This is something similar. And remember, this activity, you are going to tell us 
or send an audio in the WhatsApp group, right? Acuérdense. Entonces, esta es su actividad del día de hoy, chicos. Cualquier duda, cualquier pregunta, seguiré en el WhatsApp. I had an issue. T -t Tengo que salir de Tijuana, right? Uh, but, I mean, well, this celebration of my daughter's school, right? Tengo que estar en el recital de mi hija. So, I'm sorry, guys, for this. Um, but, please, do the activities. Acuérdense, esta actividad la voy a esperar en el grupo de WhatsApp. Un audio contándonos su historia de cuando conocieron a su mejor amigo o a un amigo, right? And if you have any questions, guys, I will be in the WhatsApp group answering your questions, right? I hope you have a great day uh, and great evening. Take care. And I will see you tomorrow at 5 p.m., right? Definitely tomorrow at 5 p.m.